We're going to do displacement. Just a refresher, displacement can be in either polar form or Cartesian form. Polar form, it has a magnitude and a direction. Cartesian form, it's split into the I and J. Displacement is given different letters. In physics, it's an S. In specialist mathematics, it's usually an R. Okay? So this is Cartesian, this is polar, not really. Okay, so this first example, it's given us already, or well, pretty much, it's given us it in what form? Cartesian. So I've gone for a stroll, I've gone south. One, two, 1.2 kilometers. Yes. And then I've gone west 1.5. So how could we represent this in Cartesian? Yes, so the, the J's, positive J is in which, if we look at the Cartesian, positive J is in the Positive what axis? Positive y axis. Positive i is in the positive x. Yeah? So we've got me going negative 1.5 kilometers. It's negative because it's going left of the i axis that way, yeah? and then negative 1.2 kilometers in the J because it's going down. This is north and we're going to my end point here. So we have to find this angle here, yes? Yes. Let's label it theta. To get the true bearing, I add theta to 180 degrees. Trig to find the angle, Pythagoras to find the, the length of hypotenuse. So we've got the opposite, sorry, this is the opposite of the angle, this is the adjacent of the angle, yes? yes. So we use tan theta. Tan theta, what's the opposite? 1.5. doesn't matter. So that's the angle in that triangle. The true bearing, so an extra step, 180. So we add, we add 180 to that. All right. What type of question, uh, which exam would this question be on? Tech free or tech active? Tech active, okay, because you need an exact true bearing. And what do we put at the end of a true bearing? Um, T. T. The south, and I'm heading west. So this could also be written as um, south 51.34 west. Have you seen that before? Yeah. Yep. You could also <coughs> Convert the point three four into what? Minutes. Minutes and seconds. Do you know how to do that? Do you know the little sig uh, symbols for minutes and seconds? No. Twenty minutes. It's like a dash. 
and then 24 seconds double dash. You go the other way. Divide by 60. 0.2 squared plus 1.5 squared, yes. Okay, so we found my displacement from my origin.